Good morning. This will be a quick video for those of you who are new to Interactive Brokers on how to buy the bid and sell the ask on defaults. Of course, if you're buying the offer, you get charged a liquidity fee, and if you want to, by default, avoid that, um, there's a real easy way to do that. I like by default, so if I'm going to be trading in Hewlett Packard here, when I click this buy button, I want it to say 4077, like that, and it does. And of course it moved right when I did that, but we'll do it again. Uh, another buy order here, I want it to say 4076, and there it is. So if I transmitted this order, I would actually be buying the bid, and Interactive Brokers would be paying me the liquidity fees. By default, um, it, Interactive Brokers, when you first download it, the Trader Workstation platform, it has you buying the offer so you get filled immediately, which is what I'd say a lot of people want is to get filled immediately. Uh, but for me, I'm more worried about collecting the exchange fees. Uh, so how do you do that? If you click Settings, Configure, um, it's under your presets. And under primary order this is for buy and it'll be automatically flipped for sell orders and so I want when I click buy and this is anywhere in trader workstation platform whether it's the chart trader or um, any other trading tool that they provide um, anytime I click buy it will be the bid and anytime I click sell it will be the offer another cool thing you can do if you want to do kind of machine gun trading and um, scalp real quick moves um, you can automatically attach a profit taking order so you could say profit taker change this to none and limit and make it let's say uh, six cents and apply and do okay okay and who's moving So watch this. So I'm going to click Baba, and here I'm going to buy the bid, and I'm going to sell. And if I transmit one of these, they both transmit. Um, so this would be good for those of you who want to do real quick scalps. You could set your program up to automatically do that.